Hello, welcome to the Spoon for Heart Kitchen. สวัสดีค่ะ My name is Jerry. Today I'm going to show you how to make the crabbed roe with spicy sauce. First, we're gonna prepare all our vegetable. I start with our cabbage. So we have to pick the small knife and then remove the middle. Try to take the the middle part out. And here we have our cabbage lady. So we remove this because uh, easy when we want to use. I'm gonna sit it on the side and prepare the next vegetable. Vegetable, and now we're gonna start cooking. Heat your pan and get your oil hot. Now I already pour the the vegetable oil inside the pan. And next, when oil hot enough, I'm gonna put the our garlic. Mm. Every time, I love the garlic, frying garlic. In the hot oil, the garlic cook really fast. Now my garlic is golden brown. I ready to add our meat. I use cow turkey today. And when we cook our meat, we still can cook our vegetable at the same time. The whole cabbage that we uh, remove the bottom earlier. Now uh, we have the boil water. Already, I gonna put the whole thing inside the hot boiling water. Okay, and I gonna give this a cover. And now your meat is cooked. Next, I gonna add our carrot. And next, it's gonna be mushroom. Put it all together. Mm. Mushroom carrot. And also we have a green onion. Everything is the same size. Put them all together. Give this a mix and medium heat. I'm gonna cover this about three minutes to allow all our vegetable, all our carrot to cook together. And now, being three minutes, the our crab base is done. Too. I'm gonna remove and put in the cold water. Hmm. Just remove and check the extra water. And then put in the cold water to stop the uh, cooking process. Okay. Okay. And now our vegetable and all the meat is cooked well together. I'm gonna give this uh, another mix. Okay. And now we're gonna start to seasoning. Okay. We start with salt. Use a half teaspoon of salt. Some white pepper, and the soy sauce, and give this a last mix. Here we done our filling for cabbage roe. So I'm gonna sit it on the side, let it cool down a little bit. And now I remove the water from the cabbage, and also I have uh, our filling uh, sit on the side. When we wait this two to cool off, we can come to make our sauce. This is a basic spicy and sour sauce for Thai, and we already cut all our vegetable already. I have a garlic already peeled. I have a Thai chili. I use a green today because I want uh, my sauce to be a green color, and. Um, also the cilantro stem and also uh, herb our fresh basil use a handful of fresh basil and also for the Thai chili and um, depend if you like spicy you put a lot a lot if you don't like spicy just to put it rest because they're really spicy and now I'm gonna blend this all herb together Here now we're done to burn our salt together. Mm. 
Oh. <laughs> okay. I remove this so I can remove all this uh, herb. Mm, smells spicy already. Mm, Thai chili is spicy. If you if you are afraid to the spicy, not put too much. Okay, and now I'm gonna put inside the my mixing bowl because I'm gonna uh, make the salt inside this bowl. Okay, I have all my herb already. And next, I'm gonna put some sugar in different container and four tablespoon lamb juice. Same thing with the fish sauce. Okay, and this mixes well together uh, because you want to the your sugar to dissolve. Okay, and then when all your sugar is dissolved, just put inside the herb that you just banded earlier. Mmm, look at how beautiful. Mm. And um, just taste it if you like more sour or salty, this is up to you. And for me, all the time my little trick, I like to put the lamb set into my sauce too. So giving extra favorite herby says. And now our dipping sauce is done. And now we're gonna start to roll our cabbage. So on the outside, you have the big leaf okay and now just have your filling put the filling much you like but do not put too much because it's gonna hard for you when you low and also add some the cilantro okay for fresh refreshing you and now you can start to low like this very much like when you load the your spring low on the side on the side and low and low here now the second one is done and I'm gonna show you uh, one more time okay so I'm gonna show you one more time and deep leaf even bigger okay put the meat and then put some cilantro leaf Okay. and low like spin roll put the side here put the side here and low low you can you can uh, like this so so your cabbage is not fold out and then this is the second one perfect and I gonna finish to do all this thing and I will see you again when I finish all of this. Now we done our cabbage roll, and I ready to try this. First, I gonna mix my salt very good and put in my dipping bowl. Okay, just a little bit. And now this one, I dip with this. Mm. This gonna be good. This gonna be good. <laughs> Mm. I can't wait to eat all this. They come out really good, all vegetable and sauce so refreshing. And it's so good and easy to make. I love and everything together. Please give it a try. And thank you so much for watching. If you like the video, if you like the recipe, please give me a thumb up, subscribe, and you will see me for the next recipe. Thank you.